Hey guys, what's up? It's Molly, aka Irish Phenom, back with a re-upload of my latest tutorial about how to get your HD settings in, for, in Sony Vegas for YouTube. Alright, here we go again. Get your clip. Drag it into Sony Vegas. Okay. I have to make two minor adjustments. I have to go through this again. Go to Saturation Adjust. Go to Reset to None. Drag it down into your clip. Put your amount all the way up, put center all the way to the left, and spread all the way up. Now for the second adjustment, go to sharpen, and go to medium, drag it into your clip. Now I leave it in the middle. I don't know what you guys want to do, it's your choice, but this is the best quality for me. Alright, now, here's what I left out. You might have a 16.9 aspect ratio on your um, videos, or you might have 4.3. Either way, to get rid of those bars at the top and bottom, go to Event Plant Pan Slash Crop. Up here, you're going to see a drop-down window. I don't know why that keeps going in there. It's really annoying. You're going to see Default. Go to 16.9 widescreen TV aspect ratio. That's going to take out all those black bars. And on your YouTube video, close that out. It might show you have the black bars on the um, preview video screen here, but it will not render as that. All right, go to File, Render As. That's the last couple adjustments to make. All right, let's go. Why is this taking so long? Okay, go to Windows Media Video 9 template, go to 3 megabytes per second video, now go to custom, go to project, Vid video rendering quality, go to best, audio, your format, you can leave it as your default, if you go to the audio 10 professional, that's for more of a surround sound system, if that's what you have and that's what you want, put that in there, if not, just leave it normal. Your video, you're going to go to mode, CBR, format, Windows Media Video 9, image size you're going to change it to high definition 1280 by 720 now you're going to leave all this the same the video smoothness is going to go to 100 now up here you can save your template save it to whatever ASDF whatever and then click this little floppy disk button and it'll save it for next time so that's my tutorial now please go to my youtube page and subscribe sorry for this little crap video. It should be about here instead of at a channel for you guys. It should be subscribed. I'll have funny videos, gears videos, unique, all kinds of videos posted. So thanks for watching.